G'day and welcome back to another video from your boy Sports Cup. Now on today's video, it's my boy Sydney FC taking on Perth Glory in the second of what is three consecutive home games at Allianz Stadium for the boys in Sky Blue. Now last week, you can check out right here, we versed the Wanderers in the first derby of the season. Did we get up? Did we not? I'm going to let you find out by clicking right there above. We're taking on Perth Glory today. They're right down the bottom of the ladder. So let's see if we can pick up some all-important premiership points. Just made it inside the stadium. Only 23 minutes late. We've done worse before. Because it's still nil-nil, I'm still entitled to a score prediction. One word that's going to define today's game Scrappy. We're going to score our first goal ever this season at home. It's not going to be a pretty win over Perth. It's not going to be convincing. It's not going to be momentous in terms of the rest of our season. But I think it's going to start to get the ball rolling. And I think Ufik Tele is going to find a way to get the job done today. Go on, son. Go on, finish it. Uh, run at him. Run at him. Come on. Oh, you might as well. Go on, Lowe's. Go on, Lowe's. What did I say? We've seen our first goal of the season here at Allianz. It only took three games. And it's the man himself, Joseph Lolly, who probably arguably has been our best player this season so far. And the one who's looked most likely to score breaks through and he dinks it in off the post on the second attempt. Brilliant finish. And we go 1-0 up in the 32nd against Perth. Lolly. Lolly. Ain't nobody like your lolly. Makes me happy. And makes me feel this way. And help yourself to seconds. Help yourself to another serving. That's brilliant. Oh, take the time. Oh. Oh, the side step. From Robert and the run, flaming. Go on, finish. You've done some good dribbles. Time to finish. Oh! Go on, Robbie. Oh, the drop of the shoulder. I'm oh, still going. Still going, Robbie. Still going. Ah, oh, brilliant! Absolutely magnificent from Robbie. Dribble past all of them. Absolute twinkle toes on display. And it's 2 0. Super Robert Mack, Robert Mack, Super Robert Mack. Fancy a third. Oh, ho, ho, Joseph. Woo! Two words for that first half solid, solid performance. I can't actually account for the first 23 minutes of that match, but from what I saw, we actually had a good attack, like Perth just looked very static. I don't know if that's us playing really well, or if that's Perth just not showing up today. But it's, I think it's a bit of both. Let's keep that up in a second, boys. Continue from here. Hey guys, how we doing? Look at Brasquito looking fresh as F with that fade. My goodness me, you are a seismic figure and a half. If you love Sydney, sit down because I need to rest my legs because I'm old and I just did a lot of work today and I can't be bothered standing, I'm sorry. So good, so good. Oh, how good is that? Song combines two of my favorite clubs in the Swans and Sydney FC. After all, you do need something because this halftime break has gone for at least, at least 25 minutes. I don't know what the extensive delay is, but yeah, they need some filler songs and entertainment. In the meantime, Caroline. Ba, ba, ba. Okay, it's no longer funny. The delay has gone for 35 minutes. We're still yet to hear anything as to why it's being delayed. 
but I suspect it could be lightning because I see flashes in the distance. Although I'm not sure if that's a Horton Pavilion concert that's going on next door because it's not really clear. Like no one said anything. I would have expected at least a bit of a notice. Not even as to how long the delay could be, just the reason why. It's currently 9.15 local. The Yoda fence is terrified. Sydney's on fire. Yoda fence is terrified. Looks we've got some good chants going. La 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 la. That's the first update that we've received in 45 minutes. I just heard the first lot of thunder and the lightning's getting worse. I don't know, I genuinely don't know if we're gonna get a resumption of this game tonight. For the moment, I'm sticking it out, brave and true, because I gotta, I gotta be brave and true through this weather, through this atrocious, oh my God, the lightning's terrible. I'll try and get some of that for you. Look at that, look at that. Even if they can it now, I don't want to walk back in that. That is not pleasant. That is getting worse and worse. My holy gosh, goodness. Oh no. 9.53 local and we've just been told that if the weather improves, players will warm up at 10.15 for a 10.30 scheduled recommencement of the second half. You know what? I'm willing to stick around. I'm doing it for you guys to watch football on a Saturday. Why not? Last Christmas, I gave you my heart. The very next day, you gave it away. This year, the same from here. I'll give it to Ufu Tale. It's raining, man. Hallelujah, it's piercing down. Hi. Here. Landscapers are assessing the wickets. Got a bit of expert opinion from the groundskeepers over here. What do we reckon? What do we fancy? Big Rolly the Roller. Well, ladies and gentlemen, after a measly one hour and 45 minutes, we're gonna see some action again from the boys. The boys are going, Park Road! I can't believe I stayed here. I can't believe I'm still here. What am I doing? Am I stupid or dedicated? Let me know in the comments below. We are Sydney. They've done it, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah! My God. And half time, mind you, was at 8.30. I mean, this is football, right? It, it's just, it's football. Hey! After two hours, plays back on. Oh, that's brilliant. I swear, after all this waiting, if we don't get the chockies and see ourselves over the line here, I'm gonna be immensely disappointed. A new weather element has come into effect to me now. I'm freezing. I decided to wear shorts and this thin ass shirt, nothing underneath it. I'm really cold. Let's wait two hours and then throw this game away, please. Please. Pass in! Hey! 
da 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 It's 3-1. That's it. I'm out of here. It's the 90th minute. I'm going home. The game's over. You! Oh my god. Now I'm forced to watch the rest of the match because I didn't even make it to the exit gates before it's 3 2. Yeah! Well done. Hey! Yeah, the boys! Um, Sky blue. Then after what was an eternity of a halftime break, we saw it out. We stuck around to the end. We pioneered through the treacherous conditions at Allianz Stadium. In the end, we had 32 shots. 32 shots to six. Yet the final score was 3-2. Now, of course, it's our first home win of the season and our first lot of home goals of the season as well. And Ufuk Tele is, I think, finally starting to slowly turn us around, slowly get those cogs ticking and rolling over. And let's see how we'll do against MacArthur next week. I'm actually quite keen for that. It's a little bit of a pre-Christmas derby, a little bit of a derby, not quite a derby, but it kind of is. But anyway, nevertheless, I've been your boy Sports Cooper. As always, it's been an absolute pleasure bringing you another video. Stick around because there's a lot more content coming your way. And I'll see you next week in the next video. See ya. Peace and Forza Sydney FC. We've done it. Yes.